Assalamu alaikum everyone. Today's video is on my naga plants. The ones from last year, which I overwintered. As you can see, mashallah, they've got nagas on them. There you can see, I've already had about two or three from this plant already. And mashallah, they're very, very spicy. Also, they smell really, really nice, as you can see. So hopefully I've got about seven, eight more in here. And then we've got this one here. This one, I've not had any yet, but these ones are a bit large in size, as you can see. There you go, mashallah. Here, there's a few big ones here. You can see, and you've got this one here. Look, see how big they are. These are quite big. These ones here, got those there. And then, as you go along, you've got a few more in the background. Not as many as last year on this plant, but there's still a few young ones here. Also, you've got a few more. Any of you who've got nugger and chili plants, the way you pollinate them is just give them a little shake. That's all you do, give them a little shake. Don't need the insects. So they don't need anything to pollinate them. Just a little shake here, just here. Or you can use a toothbrush, electric toothbrush, just like that. I find the best way to shake them or leave them out in the outside for a bit so they can self pollinate. And then I've got this one here, which I thought was a Carolina Reaper. Now last year I only got one chili out of this. So far, inshallah, I've already got one, two and three and a few more flowers on it. Now I think actually, I think this is either a Trinidad Scorpion or maybe a Carolina Reaper, a cross of both. It looks more like a Trinidad Scorpion and mashallah this is very hot. Last year I had one chili on this and it was very hot. It took me a couple of days to eat them. As you all know I'm a chili lover. Now what I've been feeding my plants, my nugger plants, is this. That's all I've been feeding them. On this, it's very simple. Have a little read on the back, read the instructions always. Follow the instructions and you shouldn't have any issues. I normally feed them once every week and they're doing well, as you can see. They're doing very well. Very, very spicy, as I said. They are very, very spicy. And the moment you break one open, you can smell it. You can smell it from the other end of the kitchen. That's how strong they are. And that seems to do the business. I have got other chilies growing, naga plants. But they are a lot smaller and they've not got any nuggers on them yet. So these are the first ones all around here. So thank you everyone for watching. Please don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe. And assalamu alaikum everyone.